gonna tell you what I think. You feel me? I don't know if it'll come out. I wish it would. Care, that Chris. woman wants to marry a white woman. Who wants to marry a white man? That's really what she wants. She looking for a white man. She'll marry outside her race. Facts. Ain't nothing wrong with that. I no, that ain't nothing wrong with it. But that's what she wants. That's what she wants. That's what she's she around. Say she, ain't no white man. she ain't gotta say it. She ain't gotta come right hey, out well, and she say want it. Black me that got that, huh? Thought so far. Just, just to hear her talk is now just <laughs> become excruciating. She is ex like, I, there are so many women that, that get divorced for that reason, right? They are with a man and they realize that their career is going to make more money for the household than his ever will. And they get into that mindset where they feel like they have to work and they feel like at that point their family and their husband is holding them back. And like, there are so many videos like this on like on Instagram and it's just, it's crazy how it's just, it's like copy paste. Like they're, they're all having the same issue. They start, you know, surpassing their husband and they think, oh, you know, either you make more, right? So I don't feel like I have to sacrifice anymore or you're holding me back, right? It doesn't make any sense, but yeah, it's like textbook. Yeah. And the Scorpio thing is weird. That Zodiac thing is so weird to me. I don't get it at all. Danielle, comments? I don't have any. You still think she's uh, she's just asking for a responsible man? Even with the Zodiac thing? I mean, that's just a personal preference. I don't know about Scorpios or how they get along with whatever she was. I don't. I don't know. The only, gem the only um, Zodiacs I really know about are Geminis. Because that's just basically what I've been dealing with my whole life. My brother was. Most of the men who I've dated were. Even if I find a new guy who I think is attractive, they be Geminis. Yeah. So, I mean, I don't know. That's who I know about. Okay. Hmm. I don't know. I don't. I, I, it's weird to me that men find me attractive. But I don't know what I'm doing. I have no idea what it is about me or what it is that I'm doing to make men attracted to me. But mm -hmm. when I watch this woman, I don't see nothing wrong with her, but men don't agree. I, it's weird. Yeah. It's you don't see her. To understand. Do she remind you of you? I don't like being confused. <laughs> Do she remind you of you at all? How she talk, what she thinks. I've never met anyone mindset. that reminds me of me. All right, so I asked Clement, does she remind you of Danielle? Uh, Mindset, how she conducts herself. Stating what she, she wants. No, li really listen to that video, bro. Danielle don't talk like that, like ever. Danielle is, a, is all about being a wife, period. I've never heard that. That woman ain't fucking said nothing that's going to make me think she would be a good fucking wife. She would be somebody's good husband. She sold herself on how she can provide. She's not, she's a provider, bro, which is not the woman's role. She's a provider. That's why I said she needs to marry some, some woman. She's a provider. Yeah. That's what the, if she believes she's a provider, that's why she got a divorce. You understand? From the first dude, the second dude was just a rebound dude. Because she didn't want to tell everybody if she got a divorce or whatnot. She believes she's she ain't a provider. Being single. Money, though. Listen. So she because of the her, her, No, listen. When a woman say, I outgrew you, because I'm going to be the provider of the house, you can't provide. I'm going to do it. So I don't need you. I'm not going to take care of you. You're moving too slow for me. You're not keeping up. That's what that means. That's how that translates. So you either make more than me so I can put all the bills on you. She said it earlier when she said, "You, I'm gonna, I make six figures, but you need to make this." Yeah. So and she gonna keep all her money. No boo. Mm -mm. No, you won't. <laughs> that let me let me here deposit. Get us to your employer. I need this going in there. Thank you. Yeah. The the issue she That's wants. A good work. She wants to use her money to what, like, for what she wants to use it for. But 
and she doesn't want to have to cover the bills if she doesn't have to. And so a man coming in and adding on to her bills this isn't attractive because she doesn't want to have to work to cover the lifestyle that she has, plus him as well, right? So that's understandable to me. It is, it is, but the issue is, is are you doing it in a way that's desirable, right? Like there is give and take, like, yeah, you can want that, but can you get it? Do you know how to get there? And I don't think she's at the best. Men, (laughs) men do not look for women that, men look for women that they have to take care of. This is the exact opposite of the advice that women women give their sons. But men look for women who they have to take care of. There is nothing fun about dating a fucking woman who can do absolutely, or she better pretend that she got damn need my ass. Hmm. She better pretend. Why do women only got to need you financially, though? Why can't she need you for everything? Because it's just fun. It's damn fun. We like bringing y'all shit home. We like them. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, sure, so, you can go. Buy it, let let me do it. So I think her it's her deeper her than own that. Money mean that you can't bring her stuff home. No, I think it's kind of. I think it's person kind of scary for a man to think the minute I start making less than her, she's gonna leave me. Like, if I'm not constantly making more than her, beating her in this competition of who can make more and who can cover the expenses, she's going to be out. And I don't think any man logically can see themselves entering into a long-term risky relationship, knowing that if something were to happen to them, she's doesn't want, she's not going to be there anymore. Right. So they would rather enter in a relationship with a woman who actually feels like that, but lie about it. What? Or just get with someone who actually (laughs) wants it. Or a woman who you just now know she Ain't never gonna make more money than you ever. I don't give a damn. She lived to be 150 years old. She's not gonna make more money. She's okay. not, she's gonna always need you for something. Or she's, or she's not gonna, gonna show you that she needs you. Like realistically, beyond the money aspect of it, is just the fact that it's like, all right, we can actually teach you something. We can actually you're okay being there with us despite the money. Right. Mm-hmm. The money's not the big thing, but do men do like splurging on women. We like to take care of the woman that we want. Yeah, not just every woman. Just yeah. only I, mean, the one I, under, I understand that, but just because I have my own, don't mean that you can't do that. Uh, well, I mean, I'm less inclined to do it. Mo- most that have their own, it comes with a certain level of, I guess, ego, though. Like, look at yeah. her. The second she gained much, she's like, ah, eh, you know, I outgrew him. He was growing too slow. Yeah, too slow. Well, that's how staying with him. It was fine. Mm-hmm. But the minute she got that promotion, the more she started making. And it became a little bit more annoying. Then she, the second she passed him, uh, he's moving too slow. <laughs> have you ever seen women who date men or have been with a man and they and they do outgrow them financially? Like what happens in the relationship? I don't know, but a lot yeah. of them women end up being old men. What happens in that relationship? A time or If that woman stays, what happens? Huh? If that woman stays, yeah, she starts, she becomes the provider role. She takes care of the, pro- she takes the provider role. And so then what happens to the man? He still is there, but he but doesn't work. Become, he's, he's not working. Emasculated. And it's so since he feels that way, then what happens? They break up. He leaves. You think so he'll re- leave? So regardless of how it goes, yeah, yeah, he'll leave. will eventually leave. So we can't fault her for, for leaving first. I don't think they leave that fast, though. I, it don't matter don't. if it's fast leave or slow. No, I mean, the point of prolonging that. No, what I'm trying to say is I think what typically happens is they try to fix the problem. The men try to fix it, right? They're like, well, let me stay home. Let me take care of the kids. Let me try. And the woman will pick fights because the woman doesn't want him to try and work hard at taking care of the kids. They want him to go out and work harder so they don't no have to do harder to take care of no kids. The men who I know who, who was with women who made more and the woman stayed, that man absolutely felt emasculated and he absolutely stopped trying. He didn't try harder. He stopped. Well, if, if so, all right. And I've seen it more than one. When, when when men always had the money, they always provided. No matter what, if a woman still had the money or wasn't able to make up the money, we always provided. No matter what, it doesn't matter. We're we're gonna provide. That's what but when the do. roles always flip, and the man now tries to do other things to supplement not having that income, the woman is not happy with that. And what I'm telling you is, I've never seen a man try to supplement. I'm my my experience is not that the man try to supplement. 
they're in a relationship. The woman makes more. They're doing their thing. When a woman makes more, she go spend more. She go want more things. That the men who I've seen watch these women do this, they just they just they just shrink. I don't really know a better word, but they shrink. They don't they don't try harder. They don't try to do more. And then, they it's look, and then they leave. It's they all leave. about they cheat. They do all type of stuff. But she the- actively, it's like he's saying she emasculated him. Like her actions because, because she made him. more money. It wasn't not not no because don't do that. No, nah, right. nah. she, she didn't do. She wasn't mean to him. She they was the same that they had been. Only thing that changed was her income and her spending. She made more sure she spent more. I'm supposed to make more and keep this in my bank account because you can't yeah, match. If, if you, so not, if, I don't if she, know about she, that. If she literally just said, "Oh, he was he was growing at a snail at a, such a slow pace." You don't words like that. You don't think that carried a, a similar kind of mentality. That acted I mean, out in her actions. I don't know about her. Exactly. I'm just talking about what I've seen, and, and, and I'm talking and about women, what I just heard as well. But what but I, my thing is that the the men will leave anyway. Even if you don't leave physically, you will leave mentally. You will start cheating. You won't be happy in that relationship. So I don't think it's nothing wrong with a woman. If leaving. you're being emasculated during the process, then yes. If it, no man, listen. The second a woman starts making more money, it's not like a man's gonna. Well, she's making a bigger paycheck. No, I'm just gonna it, go it's out not, and It's not an immediate but thing. If it's not an immediate thing, but there. A man is only going to step out and I'm not going to say only, but a man predominantly will step out and cheat when he's not gaining some level of comfort emotionally from that relationship. Man cheat just because. And I've That's seen... what I said. I'm not going to say that completely, <laughs> but I would say if they're in a happy, re- well, what. I think men mean? cheat more for no reason than having a reason. No, I, I, I'm going to say no to that one. I'm going to. Stop the cap to that one. Well, all, all of my cousins and my brothers and all the guys who I grew up with, I didn't hang out with women. When y'all ask me about stuff now, I can give I can give a, a long opinion about men and what they do and how they move because that's who I hung around. Yeah, but it's got to be. And, and me the whole thing was I was their friends, so they wasn't even lying to me about. They were so honest about the stuff that they was doing. I think. I yeah, think. But how old were they? Well, you know, it was like ten years ago because I can't be all comfy with men now. Like, yeah, oh. so they younger. They in their twenties. Of course, that's a that's a possibility. But as men get older, they just don't because they just we just don't. It's it's harder. It's not harder to cheat. It's just it's too much fucking energy that yeah, goes into it. Her mouth was similar. Was wrong. My friend didn't have. A, I don't have friends who are like are mean to men because I can't tolerate. Like my ears can't tolerate a woman who is disrespectful to men. Um, if you go find me on different lives, if you see a woman being mean to a man, you will absolutely understand what I say. That I mean that I, I don't care if I don't know this man. I could have just met this man. Ain't no woman about to disrespect another man in front of me, especially a black man. Like you're not gonna do it. I think that's, so, that's no, how no I, people that I hang around will ever have I'm, a horrible mouth. I'm pretty sure that's I mean, how I met you. You were you were standing yes, up. that is ready. absolutely how I got here. <laughs> yep. <laughs> I was like, she's cool. Like low key, I'm a, I'm gonna tell you what I think. You feel me? I don't know if it'll come out. I wish it would. Care, that Chris. woman wants to marry a white woman. Wants to marry a white man. That's really what she wants. She's looking for a white man. She'll marry outside her race. Facts. Ain't nothing wrong with that. I no, that ain't nothing wrong with it, but that's what she wants. That's what she wants. That's what she's she around. She, white man. she ain't got to say it. She ain't got to come right hey, out and say it. She wants black men that got that, huh? You'll see. How many black yeah, men yeah. you know make six figures? Besides me. How many black 